Shortest, most useless video ever, maybe, unless it takes me forever to figure this out. Alright, so, when last we left off, it was this. <laughs> How did I get him down there the first time with the block on top of him? Because, ah, uh, there, okay, that's kind of what I want. That's not really what I want. Huh, huh, hike. No, <laughs> I need to let him roll a little bit further, don't I? Okay, let's see. Um, I can, well, let me try this. Huh. Yeah, see, I don't think I can get that. Okay, wait, I did. Awesome. Okay, so now... How does this help me? I don't know. I can roll... You to this side. You should roll... Ah, no, you went the wrong way. Because what I was going to do is this. Huh. <laughs> Oh, that didn't work quite... Wait a sec. Okay, I think I see how this can work now. Alright, um... So I need to get... You down this way. And then there. And then you... Yes, okay. So now... Just send you to this side. You go over here. You, for the first time ever, I let you roll instead of stopping you. And then have you come down this way. Awesome sauce. Oh boy, I hope the last level isn't... Well, actually, I kind of do hope the last level is as challenging as this one. Uh, because then we'll actually have some video length to deal with it. Alright, another one of these little baby carts, which is kind of awesome. Alright, uh, pretty easy then, I guess. I just need to drop this and then ramp ramp over him and whoa whoop uh i don't think that's going to ramp too well but let's see no <laughs> poor guy okay well and if i drop this that kind of sends him rolling over but he got him first all right so this is actually simple in design, but a little bit more difficult than that in execution. Ugh. Is that... No, because he's not going to ramp very well, is he? <laughs> oh. Well, actually, that'll appear... What? You didn't move at all? Not the least bit of movement from you. That must hurt. A big old trapezoid stuck in your face. Restart, or the back of your head, actually. Huh. Alright, now jump! Ooh, wee! Bonk. And now, donk. Okay, there, it moved him this time. Alright, three minute video, what am I gonna do next? Next. No bonus, I can submit my score. And that takes us to congregate, which is not actually submitting my score. Stupid website. Uh, there are user levels. I suppose I will try one. And I guess if I'm gonna... Whoa, hey. A little bit of lag there because it's going to some other server to find the levels. Come on. Alright, go back. Now go back into the user levels. And I want best rating. And these are the best rated. Let's try this first one. Oh my gosh, look at all of this. And look at this ball right here, moving. Oh, did you see that? Okay, what, how do I... Let's get rid of that. And let's get rid of that, and get rid of that. Donk. But I lose because he fell off screen, right? Yeah. Alright, let's try that one again. So yeah, when you click on this, it flings him up into the air. Click, whoosh! And that was kind of pointless. 
I don't like it when there lacks the reproducibility. See, that time it launched him straight up. That time it didn't launch him straight up. So where does it... What determines how he's going to be launched? Is it based on the way his head is facing? Oh. I suppose it launches him automatically. I guess that's how we'll do this then. Restart. Alright, you go as you were. I'm going to hit this. And it's free! Alright, get down there. Click. Alright, that'll stop that. That ate the priest. You can come on down, and you can come on down. And everybody's happy because they're all vampires now. Shut up. <laughs> Levels. And I guess we'll try this one. Holy crap. How does this even work? I don't get it. Is it possible to win this level? It can't be possible to win this level. No. Oh! I see how it's possible to win this level. I am what you would call stupid and don't pay attention. And if you're not these things, then you figure out how to win the level. I like how you cover up just a tiny fraction of the moon and he becomes un werewolfed. I also don't like that it was hidden kind of behind where it says custom level. And uh, this one looks kind of fun. Look at all of the werewolves. Click that. Click that. And you need to get rolling, moon covering piece of wood. Go! Moon covering. Okay, there. Ra! Chain transform, my minions. My miniony minions. So this, some of these user levels were puzzly, and this one basically is just a cool little chain transformation, uh, watch it go kind of mouse trap looking set. All right, check all as well. So this has been, I'm sorry, this has been Vampire Physics, ah, 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 an exceedingly easy puzzle game with many user levels, which is actually kind of cool. And I guess you, if you have an idea for a level, you can play around in the editor. And I guess that he's not a werewolf right now because the S is covering a tiny fraction of the moon. Until, oh, here's the credits. Coding by Ozdi, art by Robot Jam, and design by Kathy M, who doesn't have a website that you can link to. Aw, I bet she doesn't feel as special as them now. Until next time, bye-bye.